fair use, fair use, by the way. Um, the caption is crazy. Off rip, the caption is crazy. <laughs> this woman is going to give the case that men should only be dating single moms. <laughs> These are the same women that be calling women pick me's and all this stuff. But here she's trying to now make the case that men should only be dating single moms. <laughs> it's, you can't make this stuff up, guys. But here we go. Let's let it play. If I was a man, I would only date single mothers or people to, or mothers, period. Because I'm gonna stop you there. I'm I'm gonna, no, let me no, I'm let me, let me, let me, let me get the explanation to that. I feel like motherhood changed me so much. Mm -hmm. And although I'm married, I'm not single. Mm -hmm. Mental my mental that my it's not because I'm, I'm my my mental isn't married. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, my yeah, mental yeah. is my mental. Yeah. So when I say my, my, a lot of stuff about me changed. I value myself more. I value my time more. I don't really give my time, my energy to shit that just don't, that don't matter. Don't equate to nothing. Mm -hmm. So if I was a man, especially if I was a man that was older in age a little bit, you know, like Papa, I would literally be like, you know what? <laughs> I want a single woman because a single, a, a single mom, mom, they know how to get it done. Mm -hmm. They, they literally, they, they really be like the, the grade A people for real. For real. It'd be a single woman, the, the, them, not us. Cause I got to be careful. But when I was, advocate with that. Honestly. She cannot be serious. Actually, you know what? She is. Because right here, she's she's being a pick me right here. You see how like at the end she's trying to put down like oh, it's it's not really the <laughs> You saw what she did at the end. She said, like, it's the single woman out here with no kids and uh they're they're the ones not doing it. What? <laughs> I always say I always say this, all women are pick me's. All women are quote unquote pick me's in a way. It, especially the ones that accuse women the loudest of being pygmies. The ones that call women pygmies are the biggest pygmies. It went from I don't need to need, it went from I don't need no man to men should only be dating single moms. If I if I was a man, I'd only date a single mom. What where bruh? <laughs> Yo, that's crazy, man. That's it's wild. But I've been seeing I I'll say this, I've been seeing a lot of videos lately about this where where you'll have you're having women saying that if that men should be dating single moms like where did you say like men should they, they they should be dating single moms that's the theme of a lot of these broads videos and you're just like are you it went from i don't need no man to men have to it's like it's almost like they have to date single moms you're just like what <laughs> that's wild of me that's that's wild um I forgot what podcast this is called. I don't even know, but I haven't seen these ninjas before on a panel. One of those, uh, you know, the, the black relationship conferences. I've, I, I've seen her on one of those panels before and the other female co-host uh, co and the other dude. <laughs> if I was a man, I would only date single mothers or people to, or mothers, period, because. That's crazy. That's wild. Just that just that statement alone, because you look at the caption, you'd be like, nah, that's clip bait. You see how we come full circle from I don't need no man to I could do bad by myself to finally men should only be dating single. Men. I would only date single. If I was a man, I'd only I'd date a single moms. Then, then we're probably going to go past that point And then they're probably going to be like, nah, I think in the future, what's going to happen? I could be wrong about this. I think they're going to make it weird because there's going to be a, a point where the government can't will not be able to support these single moms like they used to. And I think they're going to make it where. Cause they're already doing it via the taxpayers' dollars, but they're gonna. I think they're gonna make it where they're gonna have certain men being required to take care of these single moms. I mean, like they're gonna force these guys to marry them. I, I believe. I believe that. I think that could happen in the future. I could be wrong, but I think in the future it's gonna be like the government is just gonna refuse to just support these people financially, and they're going to force men with certain means or with certain conditions or you know whatever. If they, like they're gonna force them to marry these single moms or just force just force these men to take care of them it's, it's gonna be crazy I, I think sometime in the future i'm gonna see that that's that's I, I i i know it sounds weird i know it sounds crazy right now but tr trust me i think in the future they're gonna they're gonna force men to wife up these sing single moms like they're gonna they're gonna pass some kind of law where it's gonna be it's gonna be something like that where it pushes a lot of men to marry single moms i i don't i don't know when that's gonna be but I think sometime I say ten or fifteen years in the future, because they, they the government cannot support fi financially, they will not be able to long term support these single mammies. They they, they just won't. They, they they have they're gonna have to off they're gonna have to offload them or offshore them somewhere else. 
<laughs> offload the responsibility somewhere else. I'm gonna stop you there. I'm I'm gonna, gonna, no, let me no, no, let me let me, let, me, let me get the explanation to that. I feel like motherhood changed me so much, and mm. although I'm married, I'm not single. Mm. Mental, my mental that my it's not because I'm my my mental isn't married. You know what I'm saying? My yeah, mental yeah, is my yeah. mental. Yeah. So when I tell you my, my a lot of stuff about me changed. I value. Well, of course, you you change. You know, when you're a single mom, when you're a single mammy, you know. All of a sudden, now you're looking for the do a, a quote unquote good dude because really you're not necessarily. It's not because you like him for real. You're just looking for help, and now you realize, oh shoot, I need somebody that's actually responsible and stable to take care of this bastard that I kept. Do myself more. I value my time more. I don't really give my time, my energy to shit that just don't that don't matter, don't equate to nothing. Mm -hmm. So if I was a man, especially if I was a man that was older in age a little bit, you know, like Papa, I would literally be like, <laughs> you know what? I want a single woman because a single a, a single. Oh, so now those older creepy men going after younger women. But they should go. But they should. They should be looking for single moms. Got gotcha. you. <laughs> got gotcha. you. We we ca copy. I got gotcha you now. Don't go after these nice, uh, <laughs> younger 20, 20, 20 year olds. Don't look to date them. Uh, that's that's you're a creep and disgusting. You you need to go after a single mom. <laughs> okay, got gotcha. you. That makes sense. Well, mom, mom, they know how to get done. Mm -hmm. They, they literally did. Oh yeah, they do know how to get stuff the, done. They, they know how to march to that child support. <laughs> that's what they, that's what they know how to do. They know how to fill out paperwork against the man that they, that, that they had a baby by. Yeah, they know how to get stuff done. All right. They know how to alienate kids from their fathers. They, they, yeah, they know how to get stuff done. They, they know how to. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Let me let me let this keep going. They really be like the the great day people for real. For real. It'd be a single women, the, 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 them, not us. Because I got to be careful. But when I, I was, was advocate with that. Honestly, <laughs> somebody said, "Man, that modern feminist brainwashing is intense." <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Some a man said, "It's because that I value myself, my time, my money, and my sanity that I don't date single moms." And somebody said, sounds like we found out the reason she's single. <laughs> oh, Lord. See, somebody said she doesn't understand, poor child. Oh, no, she, she, she understands quite well, actually. Because now that she has a kid, because she kept, she kept, she kept, her, the, she kept that one and it didn't work, she now realizes, oh, I can't do the same things that I thought I could when I was single and childless. So I, now I got to deal, like, it's, you know, when... It's dual mating strategy. She's going to keep the kid by the alpha that she couldn't retain. And now she's going to look for a beta to raise it. It's that simple. It's really that's it's a dual. It's a dual mating strategy. Now she's looking for the simp. Now, back in the days, you would have men that would step in. But now men, they're not stepping in, no, stepping up no more. Now you got these women now saying that men should only be dating single mammies. <laughs> it's, fu it's funny. They said, somebody said, I think single parents should only date single parents. As a solo father myself, it is hard to date a woman that does not have kids because they do not understand how much time and work and everything it takes, even more when you are the only parent. No, no, no. She's not talking about looking for another single father. She's look, she's talking about a man with no kids should only be dating. She, she thinks a man with no kids that has money, that has options, should be dating only single moms. She didn't just say just dating single moms. In general. She said only single moms. <laughs> crazy somebody says she has a point they are more mature and respectful some of them no nope, i disagree with that i disagree with that <laughs> i'm sorry I, I i completely disagree with that just look at the black community need i say more <laughs> somebody said yet she forgot how to put sentences together or speak in a cohesive fashion Somebody else says, why would any reasonable man choose to date mothers out of an entire world of beautiful women? You know, but like I said, men are un understanding, you know, men are understanding their worth a little bit more now. So men aren't taking bad deals like that anymore where they're marrying up single moms. This is why single mo mammies are panicking in, in nauseam. This is why they're always shaming black men for dating other women outside of the race or dating younger women in general. Because if you're a single mammy, and if you're a black, if you're a black and you're single mammy, you're really just hoping, you're praying for somebody to just come in. Because most dudes in general are not even, they're not even going to consider you, and they need the financial help. They need the financial help. They won't admit it, but they need the financial help. <laughs> somebody said I've changed a lot. <laughs> I got to download that DJ Khaled soundbite. I changed.
a lot. <laughs> I love that that those DJ Khaled sound bites, man. I appreciate you. <laughs> you smart. Matter of fact, you a genius. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. That's what I was about to say. Somebody said it here best. He said she would never, as a single woman, date a single full-time dad. Now, I'll say this. It's di like, it's different. Like, you'll, you'll see nowadays, like, you'll see a single woman with a, with a, with a, with a, with a, with a, with a uh, single dad, with a single dad. You'll, you'll see, you'll see that. But like a woman like that, like if she, like if a woman is single and childless, she thinks she has all the options in the world, you know? But I, I know what he's saying. Like a woman like this, that is saying something like that. If she was single and childless, she would not give a man. She wouldn't like, she would not give a man with kids a chance. A woman specifically like this, that are, that's saying something like that. Even though I, I, you're actually more, you're, you're more opt to see a, a single woman take a chance with a man with a kid because of the social proof. You know, a man because a man with a kid and he has full custody of a kid. Usually, a lot of the times that means he has some means, he's responsible. You know, a man with full custody of his kid or kids, that's a form of social proof to women. So women will be actually attracted to that. You know what I mean? But um, and she'll probably just date the dude just to prove that the woman that he was dating was crazy. And I'm the I'm the good one, you know what I mean? But a woman that does think like this, where she's talking about men should only be dating single moms. This would probably be the, the same person. If she was single and childless herself, she would not date a single dad. <laughs> Somebody said advertising for herself. Like I said, she's being a cool. Where, where's the pick me comments? I don't see no pick me comments. You notice that? I don't see no pick me comments. <laughs> Somebody said they know how to file for welfare. <laughs> she, yeah, Cause you say, oh yeah, single moms get stuff done. I'm like, yeah, they, they know how to file. You know, they know how to file paperwork. <laughs> they go that filing paperwork. They, I'm talking about geniuses, ma mass masters that file in paperwork against their baby father. That's what they know how to do. They, that's what they know how to get done. But that's another story for another day. <laughs> Hold on for a sec. Uh, I'm looking for that comment. But yeah, like single mammies, they're the problem right now. <laughs> like they're they're the problem. But nobody wants to say it. You know, but when people bring it up, you know, they'd be like, then, 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 then they try to bring up your mom or something <laughs> about what your mom is or what your family. And you're like, bro, single mammies are the problem right now. They're messing up the game because they're choosing to become single moms, putting themselves in binds, putting themselves in crazy situations. And, and most importantly, compromising their child's su future success or lack thereof, because we already know the stats of offspring raised in a single mom household. And we already know. Because they, they try to change it. They'll be like, no, this is what happens if a man is, if, if a kid is raising a single parent. No, no, no. Single. This is what happens with, with kids raising a single mom, raised by a single mom. These are the things like the, the like everything. When they showed you that stat where it's like 80% of prisoners raised by a single mom. 80%. They're most likely to be arrested. Most likely to be locked up, most likely to be a runaway, most likely to be abused. They show the, stat, the, the stats where basically um, a kid that's raised by a stepfather rather than his biological father is like something like 10 times more likely to be abused or something. something it was like a crazy stat like that. And it makes sense. So with all these, you would think that with all these, these stats, you would think, okay, the mom would try to make it work with the baby father. No, they don't care. That's how much. They, even to the detriment of their own kid, they don't care. It's always about them. You notice how her kids didn't even come up once when advertising why men should only date single moms. Notice her kids never came up. So you already know it's not even in the peripheral. It's not even part of the discussion. It's not even part of the discussion because it's all about her. It's never.